Don't fail me now, Iridium Rod. I paid 7,500 gold for you. Woo! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> oh, I don't know, Punchwood. It doesn't look that big up there. I wouldn't worry too much about it. Oh, hi! Sorry, I didn't see you there. Uh, well, while you're here, maybe you can answer a question for me. I was just looking at myself in the reflection there on my TV because I think the I think my hat makes this bum look big, doesn't it? Does my does my bum look big up there? My, my bum, but the bomb. It's, it's an explosive. It's on my head. I got a big bum, and I know how to use it. I mean, I'm not afraid to use it either. <laughs> I know how to use it. <laughs> I don't think that's the saying. Anyway, it's early in the morning here. Six something in the morning. Let's check the weather. Looks like a storm is approaching. Looks like the storm is already here, you dang fool. Ay ay ay. Thunder and lightning is expected. That's actually for tomorrow. And they did say it was going to be sunny today, and it's raining. This guy's losing his mind. Spirits are neutral today. Whatevs. And... Oh, that's it. Yeah. Not much on the tube today. Let's go outside in the rain. Oh, yeah. It's raining. Check this out. We got some mail. Oh, it's from Penny. Sorry about what happened at my place yesterday. My mom can get into bad moods sometimes. Please, just forget it happened. Aw, oh, Penny, don't worry about it. She's so thoughtful. She carries the weight of the world on her shoulders, poor girl. So, yeah, I'll forget all about it. Yeah, we had a, we, we walked into the uh, the camper, her camper trailer thingy, and there was a little bit, bit of a spat going on. So we kind of got involved. I probably should have just stayed out of it, but couldn't help myself. And uh, let's see, what do we got here? We have so much stuff, guys. All right, let me get squared away here. And then we shall be right back. I think I might get some uh, some cookery going here. We got some iron ore and some copper ores. Got a lot of cleanup to do. Oh, blueberries are in. Nice. All right, yeah, give me one moment. And let me put my bum away. My big bum. I've got two big bums, and I'm not afraid to use them. <laughs> and you know what else they say, don't you? Two big bums are better than one small bum. Uh, I, I think they say that anyway. Uh, I could be wrong. All right. I'll be right back. Stay tuned. Timber! All right, guys. I'm back. Welcome back. So, I'm done with all the, uh, the general morning chores here. With the exception of gathering some wood. And I think I'm going to make up a couple of field snacks here. Chuck that wood away. We need 300 wood and 100 stone, right? To make the um, the chicken coop. So we're still quite a ways away from that as far as the stone goes. And apparently my copper pickaxe does not work on the big boulders. I tried it out, but it doesn't work. Apparently we, we need um, steel to get the big boulders. So we're going to be uh, banging away on small rocks for a while, unfortunately, to get to that 100. What a shame! All right, guys, it's now 11.30, just about, and I think it's time to rock and roll. I'm going to sell all of those blueberries that I just harvested, and the aquamarine, I think I might just give that away. I think that qualifies as a gemstone. Somebody might appreciate that. All right, let's head into town. Goodbye, Wilson. We'll see you later. Okay. <laughs> Spice berry here that I'm not going to waste a half an hour to get over there to get it. Time is wasting, and we have a busy day today, as usual. So first things first, I'm going to run into town, check the bulletin board, sell my uh, my honey. Oh, wait, hold on. We have a help wanted here. It's from Demetrius. Looking for a red snapper. We'll pay a flat rate on delivery. Demetrius, 150 gold. Demetrius will be pleased. Okay, well, we'll, we'll accept that challenge. And I want to go sell my honey to Pierre. Hey, P Pierre, how are you? Good afternoon. I got some more summer spangle honey for you. I know Ms. Evelyn just loves it, so she'll come back in and buy some more, I'm sure. Uh, you might want to add a nice profit for yourself there. <laughs> and how you doing, Abigail? The valley looks more interesting in the rain, don't you think? Oh, I definitely do. Have I given you stuff all week? Let me just check here. Oh, I've given Abigail two gifts already. All right, I can't give Abigail this gemstone. I'm wondering who else would appreciate a gemstone. Maybe Robin? I don't know, a kid? I don't know. I'm gonna hang on to it. Goodbye, we'll see you later. There goes Pam, heading to Joja Mart, do a little shopping. And for right now, we're gonna head over to um, Gun um, Clint and have this frozen geode processed. 
Nobody's out today in the rain. Alex isn't working today at the ice cream stand. Hey, Clint, how you doing, buddy? Terrible day out there, terrible day. Can you see what's inside that thing? Iron. Iron ore. Okay, well, that's better than nothing, I guess. All right, thank you very much. We'll, we'll catch up to you later, man. All right, not so special after all. Hey, wait a minute. Actually, let me go talk to Clint. Hey, Clint, I'm back. I missed you. What do you sell? You sell stones? You don't sell stones. Where can I buy rock, man? I just need rock. I think, um... I think Robin sells rock. I do. I think Robin sells rock. So we're gonna have to go see Robin. I do want to get that chicken coop made up as soon as possible. Sooner than later. But first things first, we'll head down here to the beach. Oh, a clam. Somebody lives in there. And wormies. Oh. What do we got? We got a book. We found a lost book. We'll have to check the library for that. Let's see if we can't catch this red snapper for a good friend. Oh, my God. I hit the dock with that cast for uh, Demetrius. It's 140. You've got plenty of time. I do want to get up to the lake today, guys, and catch, or at least attempt to catch a sturgeon. Ooh, ooh, treasure, 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 fishy. Because a sturgeon, if we catch a sturgeon, a red mullet. Let's see what's in that treasure box. Pfft. Come on. Um, if we catch a sturgeon, we can complete the lake fish bundle at the community center, and we'll get some sort of a, a, a reward. So that would be nice. Neighbor. Pretty sure red snappers are ocean fish. They're not too hard to catch. Ooh. Ooh, maybe this is a puffer. I have not caught a puffer yet. I'd like to. It was a tricky one, but I got him. I got him. I got him. Oh, it is a little red snapper. We got him. Little red snapper. <laughs> it's like little red Corvette, but different. Nothing here on the beach. All right, let's get out of here. I wonder if I should go buy that pole. 10,000 for the iridium pole. Hmm. That would guarantee that... Oh, man, 10,000. That's so much money. Ah, heck, let's do it. Let's give Willie some business. Hello, Willie. Good day. Why am I talking like you, Willie? <laughs> you rub off. Oh, it's only 7,500. Oh. Did the price go down? I thought it was more yesterday. Here, have a red mullet. And a clam? Sure. I will take your iridium rod, sir. It looks beautiful. And... I forgot my lead bobber at home. It adds a fishing weight, adds weight to your fishing bar, preventing it from bouncing along the bottom. All right, I'm going to buy another lead bobber. And what's this? A trap bobber. Causes fish to escape slower when you aren't reeling them in. I don't understand, Willie. Can you explain this? Causes fish to escape slower when you aren't reeling them in. Escape slower. All right. Yeah, okay. I will buy one. And a spinner. The shape makes it spin around in the water, slightly increasing the bite rate when fishing. Uh, I can only put one tackle in at a time, and I really just want to make the fishing process easier so I can catch the harder fish, the ones that bounce all over the place. I, I really think I'm only going to use the lead bobber. I don't care about the bite rate too much. All right, I think I'm good. I think I'm good here. Thank you very much. Oh, wait, plus one fishing. Ooh, give me some of that trout soup there, Willie. <laughs> smells delicious. Did you make that? All right, excellent. Pleasure doing business with you. I'm going to come around and say thanks. Big hug, man, man hug. If you really want to get the fish biting, make sure you put some bait in your hook. No kidding. Oh, Willie, come on. I'm a professional. All right, let's get out of here. 320, I want to get up to the lake and get at least a couple hours of fishing in if we can. Oh, hey, Sebastian. Sebastian. How you doing? Man, I haven't seen you in days. Turn around, say hi. If you want my mom to like you, give her goat cheese. I gave it to her one year, and she wouldn't stop talking about it. That's a great tip, Sebastian. Thank you very much. Hey, uh, I wonder if Sebastian would like an aquamarine. You know what? That's a great tip. Here, have this, uh, this aquamarine. Thanks, I like this. Oh, he does. Okay, good. <laughs> I'm glad. That was a great trade. Um, I have, uh, Demetrius's red snapper, but you know what? I'm not gonna go in there right now. Let's... Uh, Alright, let's go do it. Let's go do it. Let's see if he's in there. He's usually not home. 
Oh, he's there. He's in his kitchen. Hey, Robin. Let me just see if Robin sells stone. Oh, she does. 20? For how many stones? That's not 20 for one stone, is it? Let's see. Yep. It's 20 for one stone. <laughs> Girl, that's outrageous. Never mind. I'll get my own as hard as it is. Hello, Maru. Hey, tell me a story about farming. Oh, man, I'd love to, but I gotta go. I gotta go fish. That's really interesting. <laughs> okay. That was a good story. Here's your fishy. Hello, Punchwood. You brought me the, what the item I asked for. It looks perfect. It sure is. Let's see. Here's what I owe you. Yeah, hand it over. Hand it over. 150. All right. Pleasure. Pleasure. What? Greetings. Stay inside if you want to keep warm. Nah, I gotta, I gotta go fish. I'll catch up to you later. I gotta fish before 7 o'clock. That's when the sturgeon stop biting. So I'll get two hours of fishing in, maybe, if I'm lucky. Oh, dear. Here we go. Here we go. Let's try our... Uh, let's bait the rod. Bait it. And let's toss in that lead bobber. Oh, this is so exciting! Look at this rod! Woo! Oh, it's purple! It's beautiful! Alright, come on, sturgeon! I got your number now, fool! Oh, 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 we got a hit! We got a hit! Let's check out this new rod. With my lead bobber. So it won't bounce off the bottom, which is good, because some of these little bottom feeders dive fast. Chub! Get out of here, Chub! Oh, man, 530. Got a hit! Got a hit with a max cast. Oh, look at the bobber just literally drops to the ground like lead. Because it is. What's this little thing? Ah, that's a carp. It's a big one. But I don't want a carp. All right, one hour left. I want the sturgeon. I want to finish this bundle. Get it done. I can't catch sturgeon in the fall. So it's got to be done now in the summer. I think it's summer and winter only. Gotcha. Perfect. And that's a bullhead. Ah. This is the lake, right? This is where we catch him in the lake. It's going to be a tricksy one, so I know it's not these guys. Whatever these are, they're real easy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pull head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, come on. Half an hour left. Max cast. Don't fail me now, Iridium Rod. I paid 7,500 gold for you. Woo! Whoa! Forget the treasure. No, that was him. That was him. Wow. Okay, well then. Um, that lead bobber is not going to help with that crazy freakazoid. It will with this guy. Ah, oh, shucks. I'm not going to get it. I'm not going to get it. I'm not going to get the sturgeon because this is it. It's 7 o'clock. It's not a sturgeon. Ah, oh, drat. That'd be worth it. Geos and stones. Maybe I can fish for stones. <laughs> Arr. Well, it's still seven. Let's get one more in. No, it's not. All right, I gotta get to the Adventures Guild before eight and sell all my old weapons and things. I think they close at eight o'clock. Hello, fellas. Good day, Marlin. I want to sell this lead rod to you. Wow, it's worth some bucks. And my old wooden blade and another lead rod. Not too shabby. What you got here? Pirate sword, cutlass, wooden mallet, claymore. It's really heavy. <laughs> Templar's blade, 22 to 29, plus one defense, four grand. Um, wow, that's really sweet. It does a lot of damage. It once belonged to an honorable knight. Ooh, I like that. But I think I'm gonna stick with my insect head. Thanks a lot. Hey, Gil. Come back when you've got something to show me, kid. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Will do. I'm so bummed out that I haven't caught that sturgeon yet. Now it's too late. I might have to devote a whole day to this. Not giving up. Not giving up. And I never ate my trout soup. And it's, now it's going to get stale and cold. For next time. Darn. Well, we'll come back again. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Actually, you know what? Come on up here, buddy. Get closer to the treasure chest, would you? There's a good boy. Come on. Up, 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 up. All right, we got that. Stop. Now we get the fish. I want to make this worthwhile. <laughs> This whole day. Pointless. And it's a stinking carp. What do we got here? Ancient sword? Wow, look at that! It's not in very good shape, though. The blade's all chipped and bait. Gunther can tell us about it. Well, it's only 8.30, so we could bring that ancient sword down to Gunther. And find out what it's all about. 
He's open 24-7 down there. That guy never sleeps. Probably another chub. Yeah, crud. Alright, you know what? I want to try this, um... I'll try this right here. Take the lead bomber off. Oh, look at that! It has a durability. It's got a lifespan. It's a very short lifespan. Throw that on there. Um, I'm not gonna eat that trout soup right now. I am gonna wait. Well, we could do some night fishing. There's stuff that we need to, uh, catch at night for the night fishing bundle. Oh, I see. Okay, watch. When I take the thing away from the fishy, see how the reel is going so much slower? Yeah, that would have been better for the sturgeon, guys. Definitely, because the sturgeon doesn't seem to dive down like some other fish. But he does get... But he was bouncy, wasn't he? He was awfully tricksy and bouncy. Alright, so for the night fishing bundle, we need an eel and a walleye. We already have the bream. The walleye and the eel cannot be caught during the summer. So we're just wasting time, at least according to my uh, my Stardew Valley fishing spreadsheet. <laughs> Whether it's right or not, I don't know. Oh, good night, Sebastian. Thanks for that tip. Let's go see what Gunther has to say. Oh, it is closed. I thought the museum was 24-7. It closes at 6 p.m. Gunther, come on, man. You're a night owl. Well, I never see the guy out. I just assumed he worked all the time. I never see him at the Stardew Valley Saloon or anything. All right, well, I guess I was wrong. Let's head over to the saloon right now and catch everybody on the way out. Seems awfully late. Yep, here they go. Oh, hey, Shane, buddy. How's it going? Hmm, this weather makes me thirsty. Well, you just came from the saloon. I imagine you took care of that. What can I give to you, bro? I got nothing for you, friend. I'm sorry. <laughs> Yeah, go ahead, Skedaddle. Hey, Willie! <laughs> Willie doesn't want to talk. We already talked. Saloon's still open. Oh, there's Leah. I have to just go say goodnight to Leah. Hi, Leah. Hold on. Here we go. Horseradish song. <laughs> Let's get out of there. You look radishing. Whoa, where are you going? The song just started, Leah. <laughs> Maybe I should cook something new and exciting today. Something spicy. Yeah, that sounds great. I'll bring you some spice, some hot red peppers if you like. You can make something super spicy. That'd be awesome. All right. Yeah, I'll catch you later, okay? Yeah, let me walk you home. So, yeah. So, I was fishing for a sturgeon today, right? And I caught uh, caught some chubs and I caught a red snapper. But that sturgeon, man, he's really elusive. Very, very difficult to catch. Um, I guess we're almost there now. Okay, here you go. Come on, hurry up. Hurry up because I'm getting sleepy. <laughs> All right, good night, Leah. Whew. All right, got to get home. Gotta get in the house before two. That was a gentlemanly thing to do, is walk her home in this pouring rain and dark. But now I might pay the price. I might pay a heavy price if Joja Corporation has to pick me up off the ground. Oh, watch out. Roots and stumps and saplings in my way. We're gonna make it. We is gonna make it. We is gonna make it. I'll sell stuff tomorrow because I already have blueberries sale. In the bin, so... Oh, what's that? Achievement get. Cowpoke. I'm a cowpoke? What does that mean, I'm a cowpoke? I didn't poke any cows. <laughs> Somebody's spreading dirty rumors about you, Punchwood. So, 2,530 gold. Not too shabby. And the blueberries got us 2,400. Nice. And I guess that's it for now, guys. That's the end of the 26th of summer. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Another rainy day.